Hello everyone, my name is Ross Hotchkiss. I'm working for Carrington Boats on the Medellia refit for Pip Hair Ocean Racing. So first of all, we bring the boat into the shed. We block the boat up under the cradle and get it all level, ready to start marking out all the cuts using a laser. We'll line the laser up on certain points that we've measured from center line and water line. Here we are with the old foil holes. We've marked up ready to cut out the new holes. And on the bow, we have Warren just doing his final checks on the cut line. And he's marked out any structure, so he's drilled through holes to make sure he doesn't cut into any existing structure inside the boat. Before he does the cut, he'll prop up the, the bow and make sure he's got the, the first cuts ready for the bobstay chain plate, which is what he's starting to cut out now. Cuts along the bobstay chain plate and back to the most aft point of the boat where the cut finishes. So using an array of different tools, a jigsaw to cut along the structure that he's marked out from the inside to get a nice square cut. Uses a fane saw to do the cuts on the monolithic points which have got no core there, it's just pure carbon. Just got a few more little bits to take off on the inside. There's some omega structure which runs across the boat. He'll just do a final cut of a Sengar. And that's it, the bow's off. And as you see inside, you can just see the bobstay chain plate, which is where the new bow section joins to. Warren then starts to prep inside the boat. And here we are with the deck. We've done the final marks on the deck. We'll start cutting out. Got to stay clean with our suits. We are cutting along the mast step, so we've got to be careful to stay away from all the structure. A very complex area, this part of the boat and the deck. So once the deck's cut, we can start cleaning all inside, removing all the old structure. Here we're getting ready to join the deck back in. All the structures in there, the foil cases have been reinstated, the new bulkhead, the new wet box, everything's done. So we glued, glued the bow panel back in. It's then been taped, so all the secondary bonding's been done and filled. Then we do a post cure, making sure we get the, the right structural integrity and all the fiber. Here we have a splash on the side of the hull where the new foil holes are going to be. And so this keeps the structure nice and strong while we're doing all these reinforcements inside the boat. Once the reinforcements are done, we mark out for the holes. All the mast bulkhead needs to be reinforced. There's so much fibre to put on because the loads are so much going through this new structure. So these plants in the top of the uh, upper bearing in the foil case, they help us align everything. So these vertical faces are a certain measurement from the center line of the boat and the horizontal faces on top are a certain measurement and height from the water line. So now the deck's been prepped, it's all been glued, all the structures in the boat. You can see you've got the aft panel which is helping waterproof inside the boat. You've got the forward foil bulkhead. This is a fine this is a good moment for everyone, it's a big milestone. The deck gets put back on. This is where you start working in a very dark cave. 